hello guys and welcome back so as you know that in the previous video we have created our project in unity by the name of parkour game now in this video we will be uploading all of the assets which are required for our parkour game so first of all we will start from the environment okay for the environment we will be using this steam city let me tell you guys that I don't own this asset, okay, or any of these two assets. These are from the Unity Asset Store, as you can see right here. This is the Steam City right here, okay. So you can get the Steam City from Unity Asset Store. Anyways, right here, now what will I do is I will simply extract this zip file, okay. So I will right click then click on this winrar okay you can download winrar from online website of the winrar okay then simply click on this extract to steam city after that it will give you this folder by the name of steam city and if you open that up in here you will find this unity package file by the name of steam city as well so what we're gonna do is simply double click on it and it will automatically open up our parkour game project it will take a minute or two and after that you will see this import unity package window okay and as you can see in here we have all of the environment assets and the scenes okay so let's click on import and now importing will take few seconds or maybe a minute let's see right here as you can see the steam city has been added inside our project it took few minutes i think five or six minutes and after that it is now imported so now what we're gonna do is we will open up this demo scene and in here let's open up this city scene and as you can see right here everything is in pink color okay this is due to the materials are not compatible with our urp pipeline okay or you can say universal render pipeline so what we're gonna do is now we will change the materials or you can say convert the materials to urp so for that what we will do is we will get back to the steam city folder and we will open up this materials folder as you can see all of the materials are pink so let's uh, click the control a button and it will select all of them let's hold down the control button and left click on this folder to deselect it okay and make sure that you select the other materials then right click and actually we don't need to right click we need to click on this edit okay then click on this rendering make sure that all of the materials are selected as you can see and then click on this material and inside the material we have this option okay convert selected built-in materials to urp click on proceed and now as you can see all of them are now converting to urp so let's just wait for it now as you can see all of the materials are converted as you can see these three are not converted but this is for the steam girl okay we are not using that girl character so we don't need to change that okay now as you can see most of the materials are updated to urp but not all of them so now let's get back to the steam city folder actually we need to go inside this materials and then this swappable because now we need to convert all of that as well so select all of them and then convert to urp and now as you can see all of them are converted and right here as you can see these materials are not so let's select this object this is the material let's right click and then click on select material okay it will open up the materials folder which is inside steam city mesh 
and then materials let's convert all of them as well click on proceed and now as you can see all of the materials are converted but now we have other problem which is this one as you can see the leaves are not looking perfectly fine so what we're gonna do is simply select these okay this four leaves then we need to I think open this up okay right here we have this four leaves material let's click on select material okay this is the material and now right here what we will do is we will change the surface type to transparent now as you can see it is now looking fine as you can see okay just simply change the surface type to transparent from opaque and now we're gonna do the same with this one as well okay so let's select this object which is by the name of IVY open this up so select the first LOD then click on select material this is the material let's change this to transparent as well okay and you can smooth this as well and also if you want to remove this white thing as you can see it is showing some white type of thing like a glass so for that just simply uncheck that box okay so it will be removed as you can see okay you can do the same with this one as well as you can see there is this white square type of thing okay so select it the fall leaves and click on select material click on it and then uncheck that as you can see okay now let's check these trees okay we need to set these trees as well so select the trees make sure that you open it up and select the park material i think the park material is okay but we need to select this leaves material and let's change this to transparent and let's uncheck that and now as you can see the tree is looking perfectly fine okay so in this way you can change all of the materials and you can set the leaves and other things as well okay so now i think our environment is all set up as you can see now the next thing which we will do is to add the character and the parkour obstacles okay as you saw in the introductory video at this location we have some obstacles okay so we will be importing that obstacles and also our character but we will do that in the next video.